That's send it to me there. <laughs> yeah. Hi, so I'm joined today by uh, Lorraine Martin from Network Rail and Shelley Caton from our HR department. And we've just been having a very interesting conversation about diversity and what we can learn from Network Rail. So, uh, Lorraine, perhaps a couple of quick thoughts just to capture this afternoon for me. Yeah, really great conversation with Steve and Shelley, really, about how we can make, um, how Network Rail has been working to make us a more open and inclusive organisation. I think one of the things that would be really good to see you do is around your monitoring, so you know the composition of your workforce. We did that, and one of the things that was quite telling was when we looked at the size of our um, male workforce versus our female workforce, we reckoned that it would take 65 years for us to get more women in. So good luck to you on that front, but it might be one of the things that you might want to complain. And I'm also really impressed that you're, in, you're undertaking an unconscious bias training, because we rolled that out across the organisation um, for the last couple of years, and we've had over 3,600 people undertake it. So I think that's a really great way forward. That's brilliant, thanks. And Shelley, what, what, what's your reflections from today? Oh, loads of great stuff about um, diversity champions and um, how diversity champions really help kind of spread the message and kind of engage people's true beings. And so I'd really like to explore that. And so if anyone out there is interested in becoming a diversity champion, then please, please let us know. It'd be great to look into. Great. Great. Thanks, ladies. Thank you.